time the tour director at Sarnia Valley High School. Yeah, he's the coolest guy in the world. I just want to thank you all for coming to our awards banquet. It's been a wonderful year. I know I've said it to several people, and I have not sure where the time has gone. I can't believe it's already a late day, and we're only a couple weeks away from summer. But um, it was an amazing year for our educational music program, and I'm glad that we can all come together here to celebrate our students tonight. Um, Alright, so let's, let's go ahead and get started. Now, for tonight's MCs. Introducing my favorite student here. Why is that written in here? The inseparable duo, most talkative girls in class, most likely to start beefing with each other or even with me, Tara and Kaylee. Take it away. Yeah, I know people. They're pretty cool. Very friendly, too. That's amazing. Oh wow. That's really funny. Wow. That's cool. Oh wow. <laughs> awesome. That's really cool. Yeah, well, we're the ones in charge for today. Oh my god. I think that's the time when I was Mario. That's what I know. I was going to say, Mrs. Sheeta. Oh, memories. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Way too fast. I agree. I there agree. are so many memory, memorable things that happened this year and so many amazing people to celebrate. Speaking about the wonderful music program and amazing people to celebrate, we're honored to present the spectacular students who won awards this year. These students who have demonstrated themselves exceptionally in the music program were nominated by their classmates for these awards. Now, first off, we'd like to celebrate individuals who have displayed <laughs> tremendous progress throughout the year. These students are recognized for their persistent efforts and optimistic attitude and were selected by their peers for the most improved award. <laughs> From our amazing concert band, while the student had never picked up an instrument before his freshman year, his positive attitude and willingness to learn have made him happy. Kid. You can find him playing percussion in class or making mushroom jokes at lunch. Please give it up for Bryce Harville. Wow, Bryce Harville.
Harvin. Josh, one of his, uh, yeah, he's one of our spirits in the Smile Game class. This is Josh. Here he is. Here it goes. Hello, everyone. My name is Josh Toy, and I'm the president of the San Ramon Valley High School Music Mentors Club for the 2023 to 2024 academic school year. For those, who, for those of you who do not know, the Music Mentors Club is a student organization founded in 2021 that aims to inspire, support, and guide a passion for music among the younger students throughout the California East Bay. In the process, we pair up a high school music mentor with an interested mentee from any of our local, elementary, and middle schools. Then, a relationship is formed and the mentor teaches the student throughout the whole academic school year. I encourage you all to consider joining for an amazing experience. At this time, we would like to recognize all the officers who served this school year. When I call your name, please stand up. Vice Presidents Tram Dillon and Bella Patel, Wow. Mm -hmm. Secretary Naomi Nguyera. Yeah. Ambassador Lindsay Delanoy. Yeah. And Officer Ricky Lee. Yeah. Awesome. And okay, with that being said, we would also like to announce the leadership for the next year. When you're hearing your name, please stand up. As webmaster, Divya Pavinipati. As secretary, Emily Whiteneck. As vice president, Ricky Lee. Wow! And finally, as co-presidents, Tram Dillon and Bella Patel. And as you can see, an officer position is currently open, and we are looking for dedicated members who would like to take on this leadership, leadership position in the next year. I encourage you all to sign up for the club and be part of the leadership for the next year, as this experience is truly invaluable. If you would like to join or have any questions, feel free to reach out and talk to any of our amazing officers here today. Finally, we would like to recognize all our mentors and the top two mentors who taught the most minutes this past semester. As a whole, from the 2023 to 2024 school year, all our mentors spent a total of 7,390 wow. minutes in our wow. mentors. Wow, that is so long. Next, I'll be announcing the top two students that went above and beyond mentoring the most minutes this semester. 
When you hear your name, please come up and receive your prize. This student mentored two students totaling 1,065 minutes in this past semester. Congratulations, Divya Bhagavadi. Awesome. Let's go. Awesome. Oh yeah, that is just now she's you'll see. And last but not least, this student orchestra mentor four students by themselves, totaling 1,290 minutes this past semester. Congratulations, Naomi Noguero. This is a little off script, I don't think Josh is aware that I'm about to do this, or any of the other music So yeah. this is an amazing club, it's completely student run. I am literally a club advisor in name only. Um, so I can't thank the students enough for continuing to run this club, and it really truly makes a difference. Uh, this club started during the COVID pandemic when there's online school, and its focus has really been to give our younger musicians a positive experience, and if they've learned a few things too, it's an added bonus that the whole goal is to keep them in music as long as they are in the school. And it, as I said, it really truly does make a difference. And the way I can show you all that is shout out to Jen Noguera, who actually reached out to all of our mentees, all of the younger students, and asked for thank you videos, thanking their high school mentors. And so we have a short video uh, about that. So please enjoy. Awesome. Well, let's take a look. for small selection of music mentees. Enjoy. Oh wow, that's so amazing.
Next up, we have to recognize a few students who received special, excuse me, special recognition at one of our festivals. So this year, um, our jazz band participated in our annual district jazz festival, which we host in Saramon Valley. And each year, the adjudicators recognize special musicians who they feel, uh, through their performance, um, demonstrated outstanding ability and is deserving of special recognition. So first off, we have Enoch Chen. Also from our District Jazz Festival, we have Laurel Adrani. The next two awards are recognizing outstanding musicians for the Santa Cruz Jazz Festival, which is one of our premier jazz festivals in the region. So first special recognition is Roman Kamenetsky. Congratulations, Roman Kam Kamenetsky. Yeah, fun fact, uh, he was my roommate from Disneyland. That was a great memory I had with him. Yes. Oh yeah. And finally, also from our Santa Cruz Jazz Festival, Nicholas Natsis. Nicholas Natsis? Rock on. Most dedicated award. Next, we'd like to recognize students who have devoted a significant amount of time towards developing their musical talent, helping their peers improve, and making notable contributions to the music program. Handpicked by their classmates, these musicians receive the most dedicated award. This fun and outgoing student is a concert band, marching band, and she's a part of the band and orchestra council. She can always be seen playing the saxophone with a smile on her face. Give it up for concert band's very own representative, Natalie Kidd. Yeah! Nice highlights to Natalie Kidd. Hmm. So, I was like, hey, baby, I also like Alex Kidd. So. Congratulations. This boy has the most contagious smile and is loved by all his peers. Not only is he a member of the Band and Orchestra Council, but he's also part of our symphonic and marching band. He can be seen leading the trumpet section for solving health equations on the whiteboard. Let's congratulate our very own trumpet section leader, Gavin Osler. Awesome! Congratulations, Gavin Osler!
Great job, buddy. Yeah, he's really amazing. I'm really glad. I'm so happy to know him. Congratulations, man. You deserve it. <laughs> that is so awesome. Is that an AR or something? This student has an aptitude for almost every instrument I can think of, and he's also in almost every music class on campus, orchestra, jazz, and marching, you name it. Not only does he use his creativity to transpose music for our senior ensemble, but he is also in the process of making new music. Let's give it up for Roman Kuminich. Awesome! Red lights, red lights is Roman uh, Kamenetsky, man. Yeah, man. Red lights. Yeah. That's so awesome. That's so amazing. Moving on, I'd like to give the most outstanding award to students who present themselves as models in their classes. They're reliable leaders and diligent musicians who have a true passion for music unlike any other. This outstanding student is a concert band and marching band. She's passionate and has strong dedication with consistent practice. She's loved by everyone and known to be super friendly and outgoing. Let's give it up for our flute section leader, Briar Chang. Congratulations, Briar Chang. Awesome. Hey, Briar Chang. Instrumental 
Music Foundation booster program for all of our instrumental music here at Central Moon Valley High School. And I am pleased to uh, say a few words tonight on behalf of a very, very, very important group of people that without them, uh, none of it would be possible. And I'm referring to our hand volunteers. So if you give me a minute of your attention, I have an official list of all the volunteers that have helped us this year. Okay. And when I say your name, with a heartfelt gratitude from the board of directors and all the other parents, please stand up. And for all the rest of us, please hold our applause until I have all of the volunteers standing up so we can give them a big, big ovation, right? So here we go. Sheila Amber, if you could please stand up if you're tonight here with us. Hena and Sadi, please stand up. Okay, that's my mom, just let you know. That's my father. Just to let you know. Name my call. Yeah, we're just my father. How could I forget? And I will not forget the people that make these amazing awards and possible. Please join me in thanking our banquet banquet committee, Heather Broadway. Awesome, Heather. Oh, Heather. This is totally the great Western way. Thank you. And last but not least, this table right here is where you mm. can also become a volunteer. Please step off, talk to us, or put down your name. We would really appreciate it. 
There's other board positions that you may be welcome to check out, and we really, really, really hope you'll be interested. And as a precaution, I'm going to ask that the doors be locked, and I will not let you leave until I have them on the stage. This is just a joke. This is just a joke. I see. Yeah. Oh, silly. The next awards are a new award this year. So earlier this school year, the Wolf Tones Board decided to create the Wolf Tones Service Award to recognize students who went above and beyond and contributed positively to the music program through voluntary of their time and efforts. Uh, there are two levels of this award. The silver level recognizes students who volunteer 25, between 25 and 49 hours throughout this entire school year. And the gold level award, which recognizes students who volunteer 50 plus hours throughout the school year. So if we're going to call up the silver level first, we'll hold our applause and then we'll all come up and take a photo with our Wolf Tones presidents. So we have Natalie Kidd. Awesome. And now we went Congratulations to those people. Okay. That was pretty cool. Amazing. Hmm, I want to look into that next year. That's really amazing. I'm so impressed. And now I would like to call up Ellie Zimmerman to present our marching band rookie of the year. Awesome! Getting over to Ellie Zimmerman. Congratulations. The 
continuing on in our marching, March Band and Color Guard recognition, I'm going to call up outgoing drum major Rona Kamnetsky and incoming drum major Sean Pence to present. Awesome! Congratulations! Rona Kamnetsky. Alright, um, so basically I was on the okay. marching band's drum major this past year, um, and I just want to take a moment to recognize our leadership team that we had, because no, nothing that we did as a marching band could have really been done without the full support and dedication of our leadership team, and all of them went just so far above and beyond uh, what was expected of them, and performed really well at their duties, and I really appreciate everything that they did for this program. And I really especially want to appreciate Sean because he's done so much. He's gone so like far above what was expected. He's gone so far above what's expected. And I just really appreciate everything that he's done for this program. So I'll give it to him to talk more about the next year's leadership team. Awesome. Hey, hi everyone, I'm Sean. I will be the drum major next year. So I'm going to be announcing the 2024-2025 Marching Band Leadership Team. So can this year's outgoing leadership members please come up? I'm Sean Kent. Okay. And then you're leading leadership, come on. So it shows we got Sean Kent as the drill major. That's awesome. Congratulations to Sean Kent. All right, so first up, we have our co high rap section leader, Enoch Chen. Enoch Chen. Our co high rap section leader, Madison Chin. Awesome. Congratulations, Madison Chin. Our low brass section leader, Ellie Zimmerman. Awesome! Ellie Zimmerman, congratulations. That's so cool. Our band manager, Gavin Osler. Congratulations, man. You got it, man. Gavin Osler. Our color guard captain, Divya Bahamadapati. Oh, wow. Divya Bahamadapati. Awesome. That's a kind of long one. That's a kind of long one. Our professional captain, Zach Liu. Awesome. Congratulations, Zachary Liu. And last but certainly, certainly not least, assistant drum major and co woodwind section leader, Ricky Lee. Yeah, Ricky Lee. Awesome. That's so awesome. That's so amazing. Yay. On my tripod. Oh. Oh. Next up are our director's awards. So these awards are given uh, directly or expressly through my choice of the director. When I go about some of these awards every year, my tendency is to try to find some students who fly under the radar but are excellent musicians and even better people who are always contributing positively to our music program in their own way. And for 
for whatever reason may not be getting the recognition they deserve. So first up, our marching band directors of war. Uh, this person is an outstanding member of our color guard. She is always focusing on making sure she's doing the right thing at the right time, always hoping the guard get better, has a positive can-do attitude, and is all, truly always looking up, looking up for the band to make sure that they're doing the right thing at the right time. And so I don't know if she's here tonight, but uh, let's give it up for our director's award for Marsh Band, Ellie Maddox. Ellie Max. Awesome. It's okay. No, it's okay. Next up for concert bands. Similarly to Ellie, this person is always doing the right thing at the right time. You might notice that's a trend. Um, she is an excellent musician, but she's always looking out for others around her. Uh, she gets, even though it might not seem like it if you just listen to casual conversation, she does truly care about her section mates, even though they often bicker. Uh, <laughs> but they, uh, this person really does have a kind heart, and I can't wait to continue working with them for the next three years. Give it up to our concert band director's award, Andrew Minigan. Andrew Minigan.